Welcome, and follow me as a Xiaomi 13 and today I will show you how you can enable and also set up your Do Not Disturb mode. Now to get started, simply pull down your notifications and then on one of the pages you will find Do Not Disturb mode. Now it is shortened in here as DND. So once you see this icon, moon icon with a DND under it, that's our Do Not Disturb mode. So when you find it, hold it at least the first time around and this will take you to the settings where you can customize how it will function. And here you want to just scroll down and check out the settings that we have. So where is it? Oh, there we go. Do not disturb mode. And we have the toggle to turn it on. When the device is locked, that, mean, that means that even if it's enabled and you select this on, it will only function when you lock the device and not when you're using it. Then we have notify, notify about callers. You can select who can call you, message you, or at least in this case only call you. So you have anyone, contacts, favorites, or well, no one. Select whichever one you want. There is also additional setting for calls, meaning if someone calls you twice within a 15 minute period, uh, they will bypass whatever you have selected right here. So, might not be the most optimal setting for everyone. Uh, if you have some, I don't know, spam calls that are very persistent. But in terms of emergencies, I think this is a pretty nice thing to have. And below that we have a schedule. So, you can select a custom schedule. So, it allows you to select when the Do Not Disturb mode starts, ends, and then repeats uh, throughout each day of the week. You can select each one of them. So, there we go. Now, if you're planning to use a schedule like this one, just make sure that it is toggled on like this, and that's all you would need to do. But for everybody else who wants to use it manually, all you would do is find the toggle, tap on it, and it is now running. Now, with this in mind, if you, top, if you toggle it manually, you will also need to remember to turn it off yourself, otherwise it will be running in the background indefinitely. And obviously you might not want to have some of those settings running permanently in the background, like uh, for instance, call-wise, call where it just won't, uh, won't notify you about colors or specific colors. So obviously to turn it off, you just press on it and everything should go back to normal. Now, with this being said, if you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.